At just 16 years old, she won the hearts of people around the world when she became the first American woman to win the Olympic gold for a gymnastic event. America's sweetheart Mary Lou Retton went on to become a motivational speaker, an author, sports commentator, and a mom. It is so good to see you. Thank you. Thank you for coming in. Oh, my pleasure. First of all, I heard you just had a birthday. <laughs> you turned 40. You look fantastic. I did. You're so sweet. Thank you. It's, I did. It's an age a lot of women dread. It, what about for you? Was it difficult for you or not? You know what? Not at all. I think I had more problem turning 30 than I did 40. I just, I want women to embrace it. I just feel so much more confident in what I know and who I am and what I believe in and stand for. And I am so looking forward to this decade. I love 40. I really do. Well, and you're an inspiration to all women, I think. Thank you. Thank you're you. the mom of four beautiful girls. Yes. Do you, would you say it would be harder to train for the Olympics or to be a mom? <laughs> <laughs> That's a no-brainer. I mean, being a mother. And, and think of this. When, when I was training for the Olympics, it was eight hours in the gym every day. Intense, high, high, high intensity workouts. Mm -hmm. But when workout was over, it was over. And I had some me time. But being a mother, as you know, that's a 24-7 job. It is tough. And there's not a lot of time for me. Um, so it's definitely the toughest job I've ever had or ever had to train for. But it's the most joyous, and I get so much out of it. I love it. I'm exactly where I want to be in my life right now. And priority is mom and wife. How do you find that time for you, and what do you do if you get a little bit of time for Mary Lou? For me, um, downtime, I like to pray have my quiet time. Um, if I've got a little bit more time, exercising, massage, all those things are big treats for me. And that, when I, when I take that time for myself, and as, as you would probably know, as a working mother, you're a better mother. Mm -hmm. You come Absolutely. back refreshed and re with a better attitude to, to take on the, the crazy day that we have every day. You wear so many different hats, a motivational yeah. speaker, a mother, an author. How do you balance it all and still have time for your family? It's hard. It's a daily struggle. It really, really is. I think what helps me are, are two things. Try not to be superwoman. You cannot do it by yourself. You've got to ask for help. Um, family members, husbands, people that can actually, you know, we tag team a mm -hmm. lot. And second, I think um, being organized. You know, in my training, I was on such a daily regimented schedule, and I really have taken that over into my daily life now as a, a working mom to be organized, and the day runs more smooth, smoothly. Mary Lou Retton, it is such a pleasure to have you in the <laughs> studio. You. So nice to meet you. Thank you so much for coming in.